Welcome back to Simplified Triple E Studies. In the last session, I have explained classification of control system, and there are two classification: open loop control system as well as closed loop control system. As I was discussing open loop control system, I have covered what do we mean by open loop control system, one general block diagram of open loop control system, and some typical examples of open loop control system. Today, I'll be classif, I'll be making out what are the advantages and disadvantages of open loop control system. Advantages. As well as disadvantages. What are the pros and cons of open loop control system? Let us have a brief discussion. First advantage is it is too simple. There is no complicated design. Simple in construction. Simple in construction and design. True fact. It is economic, cost effective, easy, easy maintenance, hundred percent true. No stability problem, no stability issues. It holds the system stable. That is correct fact. Then convenient to use when the output is difficult to measure. convenient to use when the output is difficult to measure these are the advantages few advantages of open loop control system but there are certain drawback let us figure out what are the drawbacks of open loop control system first disadvantage is inaccurate that is true inaccurate why it is inaccurate why because we are not sensing the output will be the controller will be setting desired action but output will not be the output will not be sensed by the controller or sir, there is no feedback that's a main problem so we we do not know what will happen for the output controlling action will be entirely independent of output that it may it may it may be leading to inaccuracy okay that is why it is called inaccurate second is unreliable it is applicable only for some certain system but not for applicable for entire system why because reliability that is another issue okay we cannot uh, may say that a open loop control system is reliable it may give inaccurate result it is unreliable all right poor accuracy it is not an accurate control methods another drawback is any changes in the output cannot be controlled automatically okay that means disturbance disturbance cannot be filtered out why that, that, that's why it is called any changes in the output cannot be corrected automatically okay so these are the few uh, disadvantages of open loop control system and these are the advantages i think you can bifurcate what are the advantages and disadvantages very easily So next session I will be discussing about a closed loop control system in detail. Thanks for watching this video. Please share and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.